Hi, my name is Mark Bissell and I'm the Senior Applications Engineer for CamWorks. I'd like to show you some new technology that uses smart manufacturing to significantly reduce the time required to create CNC programs. CamWorks' new tolerance-based machining leverages SolidWorks dimensions and surface finish annotations to select the correct machining strategies and machine to the mean of asymmetric tolerances while automatically generating a CNC program. Here's the SOLIDWORKS model that includes MBD data. The dimensions and annotations displayed were added to the model using the DIM expert functionality included in every seat of SOLIDWORKS. Now you might be thinking, but we don't get models that have dimensions on them. When we get models, they come with drawings and the drawings have dimensions and tolerances on them. So before we go any further, let's read a model into SOLIDWORKS that doesn't have any dimensions and see how easy it is to add the additional information to the model. Thanks to CamWorks knowledge-based machining, we don't need to add every dimension on the drawing to the model. Dimensions and surface finishes that fall into the standard tolerance block will use the standard machining strategies that we've already saved to our database so only the close tolerance dimensions, unique surface finishes, and asymmetric dimensions need to be added. Let's start by adding some of the unique information from the drawing to the model using SOLIDWORKS DIM Expert. DIM Expert comes with every seat of SOLIDWORKS and is ideal for adding intelligence to the model to create a critical dimensioned model. This critical dimension model is not only useful to speed up CNC programming using CamWorks, but it can also be used by quality control to inspect the finished machine parts to assure and increase quality. In the interest of time, I sped up the process, but here's what the model would look like after only a few more minutes of using DIM Expert. Next, I'd like you to think carefully about how long it would take to program this part using your existing CAM system. On a three-axis machine, this part would require seven setups. Also, Think about the number of holes, pockets, and other features on this part, as well as the close tolerances, asymmetric tolerances, and surface finish callouts. Typically, it would take several hours to program a part like this using virtually any other CAM system. But now, let's see how long it takes to program using CamWorks, along with the all-new tolerance-based machining. I'll begin by opening up the new user interface for tolerance-based machining. The idea here is that I'll need to use different tools, feeds, and speeds to machine features with close tolerances versus those with a looser tolerance. Using this interface, I can set up different tolerance ranges for different features and specify which machining strategy I want to use for each tolerance range. On the left in this table is a list of the different feature types. Here in the center, I can see the default strategy that is currently assigned to each feature and on the right I can see how many tolerance ranges have been assigned to each feature. Once the tolerance ranges have been defined and the strategies have been assigned to each tolerance, the system is ready to automatically select the correct strategies based on the MBD or PMI data and program the part. I'll say OK and CamWorks will begin going through the entire model and finding all the machinable features using automatic feature recognition. CamWorks has the best automatic feature recognition in the world and can automatically find over 20 different types of machinable features on parts. Once all of the features have been found, CamWorks will use knowledge-based machining to automatically create all of the operations including the tools, speeds, and feeds to machine all of the machinable features on this part. And now, with the new tolerance-based machining, the SOLIDWORKS dimensions and surface finishes will be read, used to automatically select the correct machining strategies, and machine to the mean of asymmetric tolerances. Just that quickly, CamWorks has now programmed the part. Let's go take a look at the results. Here in the feature tree, we can see that CamWorks has automatically created all seven setups required to machine the part on a three-axis machine. If a four or five axis machine is selected, CamWorks automatically uses these setups to select the correct index angles for machining. Under each of the setups, we can see the machinable features that can be machined from each setup or index angle. And here we can see some of the features that fall into a specific tolerance range that have been identified and the range has been added to the feature name. Next, we'll go over to the operations tree 
and see that thanks to the new tolerance-based machining, the correct machining strategies have also been selected for all the operations. For example, these holes have been reamed rather than just drilled due to the close tolerance that was specified using SOLIDWORKS DIM Expert, and the same is true for the other features with close tolerances. Here you can also see some of the operations have been renamed with the mean value required to machine the asymmetric dimensions to their mean. For example, on this pocket a value of .0125 would be required to machine the pocket to the mean of its tolerance. Note the other operations that have been renamed and have other similar mean values assigned. In addition, on the surface designated with the 250 surface finish, we can see a coarse step over has been used. On the surface with a 125 finish, a smaller step over was used. On the surface with a 63 finish, a finer toolpath has been generated. And on the surface with a 32 finish, an even finer step over was used in order to meet the surface finish requirements. Before we wrap it up, let me ask you again, how long would it take you to program this part using your CAM system? Using CAMWORKS tolerance-based machining, we were able to program this part in less than three minutes. And using CAMWORKS, there's less chance for human error, and the CAMWORKS operations and toolpaths will update automatically to changes made to the SOLIDWORKS design. The combination of SOLIDWORKS and CAMWORKS allows the design and manufacturing models to become one and the same, and with CAMWORKS new tolerance-based machining, generating CNC programs is easier, faster, and more accurate than ever before. Thank you for watching this video, and for more information, go to www.camworks.com.